Hello, and welcome to the Halloween special of Waterhouse News. But before we start today's short broadcast, it's time to sing happy birthday to Lydia McGuire, Lily Shapiro, Pat McCormick, Emily Waterhouse, and our very own Waterhouse News reporters, Kylie and Bailey Waterhouse. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. A very happy birthday to the four of you. And now it's time for Dr. Hygienia's Halloween how-tos. Hello and welcome to Coronavirus and You, a Halloween edition. Today we will be giving you ideas for a safe Halloween. Number one, a virtual costume parade. If you like being with friends and family on Halloween, then this is the idea for you. Simply put on a costume and video call your friends, family members and neighbors. Number two, a flashlight Halloween hunt. This is a bit more work, but it's worth it. Parents hide candy around the house and in the backyard and put together like an Easter-like Halloween hunt. Number three, do a gooey guessing game. Take ordinary foods such as olives, spaghetti, and cauliflower and put them in jars in a dark room. Say they are brains and eyeballs. If your kid can guess the food right, then they get a candy prize. Thank you for watching the Halloween special of Coronavirus and You a health advisor. But before we move on to the review section, we have a commercial break. I'm Brooklyn Walters. And I'm like Anna Lothland. And it's time for Brooklyn and Anna's Analysis. We'll be reviewing Nightmare Before Christmas. This is a Tim Burton claymation film that stars Chris Saradon as Jack the Pumpkin King and Catherine O'Hara as Sally the Ragdoll and Ken Page as the Oogie Boogie Man. They live in Halloween Town, which is, yep, you guessed it, a town that celebrates Halloween all year round. Though fun, Jack the Pumpkin King feels that there's something missing. They, that's something he finds in the woods when he opens the door to Christmas Town. He ends up trying to recreate Christmas in Halloween Town, and you can probably guess how that turned out. Meanwhile, Sally the Ragdoll totally keeps on trying to tell Jack that, that scaring people is not what like Christmas is all about. This Halloween movie is spooky, sweet, and silly. Th this movie p pulls you into the character's world, and doesn't, but doesn't explain everything to you. I, like, totally agree. You experience the thrill, chills, and excitement of this super cool movie. This movie is similar to Hocus Pocus in that it's spooky but not too scary. There are a couple creepier scenes and characters, like the Oogie Boogie Man, but it's otherwise a great movie for all ages. I, like, totally give this super cool movie four and a half stars. Exactly my rating! Thank you, Major Lee, for watching the Halloween special of Waterhouse News. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that bell down there so you get notified when we drop an episode. Uh, stick around for bloopers and funny clips. Have a happy Halloween! Woo!
But we far just. <laughs> <laughs> but before we start, oh no! Ah! Become a pink lady, Sandy. Come I'm on. a pink lady. And now it's time for hot, 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 hot. Make sure to, you know, you know what I mean. <laughs> Together like an Easter egg light. <laughs> an Easter egg light. What is this madness? Taller than me. I know. It's new. It's a new thing, but you're gonna have to get used to it, Brooklyn. I'm Brooklyn, aren't I? No, you're on. This month, we'll be reviewing Nightmare Before Christmas. I'm so cringe. Two, one, two, three. No, 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 no. What are you doing? Bop, Hygienia, you can bop it. Okay. I'm dancing. Is this how you have fun? <laughs> this is how you have fun, Hygienia.